Unity Core is a complete music center. It can be used to rip your entire CD collection, store and stream thousands of albums, and catalog and back up all of your music. You'll be listening to more of your music than ever before. In your Unity Core box, you will find the Unity Core itself, a document pack containing your registration and warranty information, a quick start guide, statutory safety manual, a Powerline Lite mains cable, a set of four screws to install an HDD drive, a set of three screws to install an SSD drive, and a BNC to phono connector. Unity Core's front connections include the CD slot, a front type A USB, the power standby button, and the eject button. Unity Core's rear connections include the drive caddy, power connector, Ethernet network connection, type A USB, and a BNC digital output. To start setting up your Unity Core, you will need an internet connection with router and network cable, your choice of music storage device, a tablet or smartphone, a UPnP compatible streaming player, and a POSI crosshead screwdriver if you're fitting internal storage to the Unity Core. There are several different music storage options with Unity Core. If you wish to fit internal storage, you can either install a hard disk drive or a solid state drive. Alternatively, you can run Unity Core with a network attached storage device, controlled via the name app, or you can attach a USB drive to the front or rear USB sockets. Both the network attached storage and USB can also be used as backup devices. To find a list of recommended drives and devices, go to the support section of the name website and look for Unity Core. Before you start, make sure the unit is not connected to the mains. With your POSI screwdriver, undo the screws from the back plate to remove the drive caddy. Place your drive, either SSD or HDD, into the caddy, positioned with the drive sockets sitting towards the back of the caddy. Slide the caddy with drive into the device and refit the back plate, screwing in the saved screws with the POSI screwdriver. Please note that all screws should be hand tightened only. Connect your Unity Core to the router with the network cable. Then connect the power lead to the unit's power socket and then to the mains. If you're using a network storage drive, make sure it is also powered up and connected to the network. Download the name app from the App Store for iOS or the Play Store for Android. Launch the app and follow the setup instructions to configure your Unity Core and set up a music store. Ripping a CD with Unity Core is effortless. Feed a CD into the front loading slot and it will automatically begin the rip. The name app will show a ripping monitor screen that shows both individual track progress and progress of the overall rip. Ripping a CD takes around five minutes and once the rip is finished, the album will display in your music store and the disc will be automatically ejected. Repeat the process with the next disc. Once you have ripped your CDs and have your music store set up, Unity Core will operate as a UPnP server to any network connected streamer. Make sure your Unity Core is connected to the router and that your UPnP player is also connected. It also has a digital output option for local playback via the digital input of a hi-fi system. Connect the Unity Core's digital output to the digital input of your chosen hi-fi. Music can also be played locally from internal storage, a network drive, or an attached USB drive using the name app. For further information and support, there is a dedicated Unity Core support portal on our website.